Hi my lovely friends, welcome back to my channel. I am so happy you're all here. And if you happen to be new stopping by, I am so happy you're joining me as well. In today's video, I have a loft haul to share with you. And I purchased sweaters and one blouse. And it is a cold rainy day. You might even be able to hear the rain because it's really coming down right now here in the Midwest. So it is giving me all the fall feels. So it is perfect to be trying on some of these really cute sweaters that I recently ordered from Loft. So I'll have everything linked below for you and I'm also going to have my sizing information, but we're not gonna waste any more time. We're gonna jump right in and get started with the try on. I, I am sorry if that rain is distracting because it is really coming down right now. All right, but we're gonna go on to this really cute cardigan sweater in the Barbie pink that we have seen all summer. But I love this color. I think it's really bright and cheerful and wanted to give this sweater a try. Now, I will tell you I ordered everything online and if I had been in the store to see this sweater in person, I would have sized down to a medium. I think this style runs a little bit larger than the other sweaters I'm gonna be showing you. All right, because I'll show you what I mean. It's fitting just a little bit too loose, I think, where it, I think it's supposed to be a little more fitted. Obviously, this is not a really fitted, fitted sweater, but I think it's supposed to be just a little closer to the body. So I'm thinking of exchanging this for a medium and see how that works out. But it really is an adorable cardigan sweater. I would say it is a lighter weight, extremely soft, not the least bit itchy. You can see here it has the cuff. I love the v-neck and the tortoise buttons. I think the styling of this is just adorable. I think down into a medium, it would definitely be a keeper. So when I bring these back to the store, hopefully they will have this at the store that I can try on a medium because I really think this is so cute. All right, I'm gonna go change and I'm gonna be right back with this same style of sweater in a different color variation because I thought it was so cute. I could not stop at one. I had to pick up two, so I will be right back with the next sweater. All right, I'm back with the second variation of this card again, and I will say this fits the same as the pink one. You can see that it's just a little bit roomy here. So I am definitely gonna note in the description box that this style runs larger and I would definitely size down in this sweater. But isn't this adorable with the color blocking? So this one has the burgundy outline here around the neckline. It's got this nice oatmeal in the center and then it's got these pretty orange sleeves and then the back is all burgundy. I just thought this was so cute. Really, really like the style of this sweater and I'm hoping that in store they will have a medium that I can try on in this because I think it's just so cute. All right, I do have a lot of other sweaters to share with you so I'll be right back. All right, you've probably figured it out already. I love cardigans. <laughs> so you're gonna see a few cardigans in this haul. But I think this one is so adorable. If you are looking for a 100% cotton sweater that has a really nice feel, this would definitely be one to check out. I think it is absolutely adorable. So it is a little bit on the shorter length, and, and it seems when I've been shopping recently, a lot of the cardigans seem to be this length, but it's not troublesome because I feel like they're long enough that you're not feeling like they're cropped and you're exposing your stomach, but I think it just kind of hits at a nice place on the body, so it is a little bit shorter. It has, it's got this really cute pointel detail that you can see. I think that's really cute. And the sleeves are a little bit puffier, which I'm finding that a lot of the sweaters are doing that. The sleeves are a little bit puffy. And right underneath this right now, I do have a nude cami, but I think the pointel is small enough in this one where I think you could possibly even wear this without a cami underneath, and I don't think you would be like exposing anything. But it is a really, really cute little sweater really like this one. I'll go ahead and link over here if they had 
any other colors available in this one because I can't really remember if this did come in other color options, but the ivory here is so cute and classic that this, this one is definitely gonna be one I'm considering taking. I'm really, really impressed with this one. This is definitely a cute one to check out. Okay, another cardigan, but I promise you uh, after this one, I have some other styles to share with you. All right, so this is, a. I thought the blue in this one was so pretty, had to give it a try. Once again, it's that shorter length cardigan that a lot of the sweaters seem to be coming in, but it's not too short. You're not gonna be exposing your belly. I mean, these are a high-waisted pair of jeans and I've got you know quite a bit before I would worry about showing something. So love the blue of this one, love the styling. It's also got a little bit of the puffy sleeves. Let me get a little bit closer here so you can see. It's neat that the, um, fabric it's got kind of got like white sewn in here with the blue if you can see but I do want to warn you with this one there is 10% wool in this sweater so if you have a sensitivity to wool like I do I did not look beforehand ordering this I can already feel I've got just a tank top on and I can already feel my arms are getting a little irritated and itchy so if you have a, a little irritation to wool like I do, be warned, this sweater does contain wool. And I will tell you that this is a thicker, heavier weight sweater. This is a warm sweater for sure. So if you like wool sweaters and you like them a little bit thicker, this would definitely be one to check out. Oh, hi, Lou. Louie came to join us. So really cute styling, I think, though. So if it weren't for the wool in this sweater, I'd definitely be considering it, but it, it really is starting to itch me already. All right, I've got some couple of other different styles to show you, I will be right back. All right, I am back with something other than a cardigan. And I was taking a chance on this sweater because I didn't know how I would like this, but I actually really like this sweater. I think it's called like a poncho, their poncho turtleneck or something. And I'm gonna show you how wide this is when you pull the, the sweater out. I mean, it's really wide. But it's got like a drape that when you're just wearing it normal, it just looks, I think, really cute when it's paired with skinny jeans and boots, like I have it on. For me personally, I've learned if I wear like a voluminous sweater or top like this, if I pair it with slimmer bottoms, it balances me out and it ends up being a cute look. So I just wanted to show you how I would wear this sweater with a pair of skinny jeans and boots. So first of all, if you can see, it's like a bone colored sweater and it's got the little, it looks like confetti cake, the little confetti colors all throughout. And you can see that it's got a drop shoulder and then it's ribbed here. You know, it's not really a cuff. The sleeve is mostly ribbed, but it's not full length either. It does have two pockets right here and it's got the turtleneck, but the turtleneck is loose enough where it's not like you're being strangled and it's it feels uncomfortable. It feels very comfortable on the turtleneck. So yeah, I was surprised that I like this as much as I do, but I think it's really a cute sweater. And oh my gosh, this is one of those ones where you, you're having a day where you're not feeling great about your body. You can put this on and it hides every sin here underneath. It's, it's really great for that. And I also thought this would be really cute with like faux leather leggings, you could wear it. So I think this is adorable and it's marked down on clearance as I'm filming this. Um, I believe because it's limited in sizes. Right now, I just checked and there were extra small, smalls and mediums. And you definitely would want to size down with this one. This is a medium and you can see because it's really roomy. I think if you, didn't size down, it would be a, just a little too big. So I think sizing down, if they have your size in this, I think it is really cute. And this was a real surprise to me that I like this sweater as much as I do. All right, I've got a couple more pieces to show you. I will be right back. All right, I am back with another top, and this is not a sweater, this is a top. And I was looking for casual tunic tops to wear with skinny jeans and boots like I have on now or with leggings. 
and wanted to give this one a try. And I've been drawn to the olive green, so I decided to give it a try in this color. I can't remember if this does come in any other color variations. If it does, I'm gonna put some pictures over here for you. But, th but this is a really cute casual tunic top if you like tunic tops. I like that it's got the cowl neck. It's not the least bit tight or confining up here. And I will show you, it is more of like a thermal fabric. So it does have a cuff here, but you can see it's a thermal. Now in the front here, it does have a banding and it has slits on each side. And you can see it's a little bit longer in the back. So it generously covers your bottom. If you do wanna wear this with skinny jeans or with leggings, it's a perfect top for that. So this is a nice lighter weight, definitely for early fall or for my viewers in the South. This is definitely a lighter weight top, but I thought it was really cute and I'd be curious to watch the footage of this to see how I like it on and it might be one that I end up keeping. All right, we are gonna wrap it up with a blouse instead of a sweater. And when I saw this online, I don't know, there was something about this blouse that I was just drawn to and wanted to give it a try. And let me know what you think. I think this looks like a really rich blouse. Like this to me looks like something I might receive from a front door fashion box. It just looks, I think, really luxe. And let me know if you think the same too. That's what I thought when I saw this blouse and I wanted to give it a try because I just thought the pattern was really unique and pretty. All right, let me get close here to show you the colors. You can see there's like chocolate brown and salmon and there is some burgundy and the cream. And I think the pattern is just really unique and pretty, I like it. You can also see that it has a little button closure here at the cuff, which is three quarters. It's not elastic, but there is plenty of room. You can see I've got plenty of room in here where it doesn't feel too tight or confining. Louie just brought in his Christmas llama. I am gonna give him a treat and I will be right back. It does have a, the V-neck and it has gold tone buttons all the way down the front. Now, obviously it's a 100% polyester, but it has a, that really nice feel. It feels like a very good quality polyester. Let me go ahead and take it out so that you can see the length of this blouse. So here is the length untucked. So I think for some reason this blouse just looks unique and I, I really like it for that reason. All right friends, so that is gonna wrap up the haul for today and once again, I'll have everything linked below for you if you saw anything you were interested. I've been having so much fun fall shopping. I think it really is my favorite season to shop for and I think Loft did not disappoint. I think they have so many cute sweaters and tops there that I usually always find something I like. So I do want to thank you so much for taking time out of your busy days to watch my videos. I really do appreciate it and I will see you all next time. Bye.